Good afternoon. I'm Lorenzo Natali from Geo Solutions. For those who don't know, uh, we are core contributors of uh, many of the open source products you may know, like Joseph, Mob Store, and GeoNode, and GeoNetwork, and so on. I am, in particular, one of the uh, people that take care of Mob Store, that is a framework and uh, an application for web GIS. Uh, this afternoon, I I'm going to tell you a story about the collaboration between MapStore and uh, GeoOrchestra. GeoOrchestra is an SDI for, uh, that integrates the GeoServer, uh, MapStore, and any, uh, now MapStore, and, any, and GeoNetwork, and many other uh, tools. The collaboration started in uh, 2019, 2019, and we wanted in initially to integrate the WebGIS of Map Store, uh, the WebGIS viewer, with GIS, sorry, viewer, uh, we, in the GeoOrchestra SDI. We delivered uh, the first official integration in 2020, uh, and it uh, gave us a lot of uh, good things uh, in Map Store too. Then we moved on uh, in the past year with developing extension for uh, urbanism or for uh, uh, cadastral applications specific uh, for uh, uh, Geo Orchestra. And then now I, we are integrating also dashboards and Geo Stories in Geo Orchestra. And we are adding a lot of performance improvements. Uh, in particular, these are a lot of promising because they increased the initial page load, page load of the of uh, the map viewer from five to seven times uh, faster. And uh, this collaboration gave us, uh, and in particular gave to Map Store a lot of additional tools that uh, now are available for all the users. In particular. One of the most interesting one is the administrative tool to create custom map viewers. Uh, with this uh, implementation in GeoOrchestra and in Map Store, you are now able to customize from the user interface your own map viewer with all the tools that you want, and you can customize also the style. So you can create uh, an application for uh, uh, for the technical user, an application for the uh, normal uh, citizen, or uh, an application for a specific office with a specific form made for you. And you can do them all using only the graphical user interface. And uh, also, uh, of course, styling all the UI. Another interesting thing that we can, yeah, we developed with this uh, collaboration is the uh, possibility to install in Map Store and in GeoOrchestra extensions that you develop separately and you install on a, an existing uh, uh, installation of Map Store that allow to customize many installations with different requirements and different tools. Uh, and, uh, so you can develop your own extension and install directly in Map Store if you want to use uh, Map Store and uh, uh, and add your work. Moreover, we added the data directory to centralize the things, uh, uh, all the configuration files, and this is this was uh, another great uh, announcement that we had. And moreover, with uh, thanking for to Ren Metropole and uh, the. Uh, that, that sponsored it, and um, in general, the OGR orchestra community, we had the, the many uh, other improvements, like a snapping uh, functionality for editing. We uh, improved our localization in, fr in French, and we added many other features, like data sources uh, support, and CRS management, and so on and so on. And this, like the GeoOrchestra, uh, like the GeoNode the use case, uh, is a good example of collaboration between communities. And this is the power of the open source uh, in, in particular. And uh, helping each other gets uh, us to the top. And nothing else. Thank you.